SGV News first out here in the city of Mission Viejo. With the USPS Mission Viejo. Check out the reviews guys. It says that uh, they call customers names. And they're rude to people. And these people shouldn't be public employees. So we're going to see if they respect the right to film guys. USPS. Got the gate wide open. Right. Got a big truck coming out right here. and see if they respect the right to film out here in public. Pretty nice day. Nice and sunny. Not too breezy today, guys. Thinking us on the way out. I don't answer questions, sir. Excuse me? I don't answer questions. Thank you. You, you are not allowed to film in this post office. Says who? Robert? He's down there. What does that mean? He's filming. He's filming. Excuse me, sir. You need to exit the premises. <coughs> Why is that? Because you're not allowed to videotape in here. Who so said? Oh, I said. federal law. Let's Are go. you the postal inspector? Let's go outside. Please. Are you the postal inspector? It doesn't matter. We'll call, we'll call the police. You should call the postal inspectors what you do. That's what you should do. You call the police first. Go ahead. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You're going to get educated on the First Amendment, the right to film in public. No, this is a federal building. Exactly. It's a federal building and you're not allowed to film inside. We'll see about that, sir. So the guy was quick to get on his phone, and not only that, but he brought somebody else out here. Welcome to the Mission Legal Post Office. Thank you, sir. Thank you. How are you? Good, how are you? Oh, I was just filming in public, and you guys tried to stop me from doing so. Okay, is there anything I could help you with? Are you just going to film? No, I was just, I mean, I've never been here, and uh, I just go around and film different buildings, so uh, that's about it, man. We have great customer service, so you guys are welcome to visit our post office. Uh, we have zero line here all the time. So anybody wants to come in, we're welcome to help. Hey, so, thank yeah, you. you know, publish it, you know, promote us, thank you. Hey. And, uh, um, my name is Alex, I'm the postmaster. Oh, so awesome. Thank you. 
Yeah, man, definitely. Go I appreciate you. Thanks Thank you so much. Day. Hey, but can I ask you a question? Sure. Are, are all the employees here educated on that uh, poster seven and, and what yeah. it means? Yeah. Yeah. Then why did he tell me that uh, I couldn't, I had to get out of here? I just talked to the guy. So. Oh, okay. And he's you are the postmaster? I'm the postmaster. He's okay. a brand new uh, supervisor. Oh, okay. So he's got a little bit to do. Right yeah. yeah, man. He so, came yeah. off pretty aggressive. And you know what? The only reason I really visited, to be honest with you, is because I saw your reviews. And there's a lot of negative stuff that people are rude. They call you names. Did he call you names? Or not? No, no, he, not right now. But that's what the reviews say. I got you. So you should check the reviews for this station. I have, I have, and, it, 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 it. and it's not nice, you know. And I got the same experience, so I just wanted to see if it was true. If it's true, then you know, then somebody needs to be taught a lesson. But if it's not true, and you are the perfect office, and hey, yeah, let's expose there's you. There's a lot you know? of good reviews, and there's a couple of negative. Yeah. Reviews. Like in any business, you know. But I just experienced an attack, you know. First this guy and then the other guy and then the guy that was standing back here right now. Uh, I'll have to review the film, but yeah, there he is right there. Yeah. The, the you need, man. You need to mail anything out, I'll take care of you, all right? All right, I appreciate it, man. Thanks a lot. Hey, appreciate it. Thank you. All right, guys, so these postal employees today have learned that... This is a federal facility, and we have the right to film in public. And uh, when you come into the post office, they shouldn't stop you and tell you that you can't film. So there it is. This employee right here also tried to stop me from filming. And the postal postmaster just confirmed that it is legal to film in the post office. Nobody should expect privacy in public, guys, unless you have private information that is being recorded, then that is against the law. Other than that, we have the right to film in public. So there it hey, is. What do you guys think? This is the Mission Viejo, USPS Mission Viejo. What do you guys think? Leave a comment um, on their website. Leave a comment on their website. Let the postmaster know that you guys are watching and that you appreciate him intervening in the situation and stopping his employees our employees from violating our first amendment right to film in public guys that's what we're going to do today teach a lesson to the usps in mission viejo I'd like to revisit this place in a couple of days, maybe a week, and see what happens, guys. But as far as the reviews that were stated online, I did experience the same thing. So, I want you guys to write a review and let the USPS in Mission Viejo know how you feel about the way their employees came out, our employees came out and try to violate the First Amendment right away. So there it is guys. First hand experience from the postmaster. He stopped his, our employees. I keep on saying his, they're our employees. Stopped those guys in their track, but I doubt the police is going to come and uh, just say welcome so everybody welcome to Mission Viejo if you have a camera if you're here for business they are uh, welcome to uh, to greet you with open arms at this point they greet you with open arms here in Mission Viejo guys I think they learned a lesson today there you go Call it postmaster, is she? <laughs> I doubt she would call the postmaster. Let's find out. Then we'll check on the fire department. There might be another parking lot on the other side. Let's check that one out.
What's up? What's up? Yeah. I think I see one you're at the uh Oh yeah yeah. Yeah yeah yeah. Check out your videos. Oh, right on, man. How you doing, man? Yeah, good, good, good. Yeah. SGB News, man. Yeah. Yeah, just out here trying, you know, checking on people. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy, like. Hey, this guy came out pretty crazy, though, you know. Uh, the guy that was inside, I guess, the new supervisor or whatever. Yeah. Hey, hey, you need to get out of here. Like, I was like, no, nah, I don't. You better call the postal inspector, and right away they came out. How long have you been doing this? Probably like, probably like uh, February is a year. Oh yeah. Yeah. So what happened? Like, just got tired. Of Oh yeah, you know, I, and, and what happens is they they uh they um they push you back, man, and and they make you pay all this money, you know, the government, you know, and, and uh, not just government, law enforcement. They pull you over, they harass you, you know, uh, and then they you know they blame it on each other, you know, like oh this is my job, that's all, I, you know. But we're out here to defend our freedom, pretty much, you know. To show people, like even like you that don't know about that stuff, that hey, you know what, you could tell the cops, no, I'm not going to give you my ID. Yeah. No, I don't want to talk to you. No, you know, go away. Yeah. You know, tell them to go away. I, I stay in Anaheim. You know, there's, there's quite a few times when I used to carry mail. I used to go home, dude. I used to pull it over. Oh, yeah. Just to approach me, like, from the other side. Like, oh, yeah. You have to put your gun on me. Yeah. Like, Film oh, it, man. I don't man. know who you are. I'm like, I'm coming from work. Yeah. Because I don't know what you have in your satchel. Like, you really do. Yeah. Yeah, that, that's how they play it. Like, oh yeah, well, for my safety, well, you're yeah. the one with the guns, you know? That's what he told me, he goes, oh, I don't know who you are. I'm like, you don't know who I am. Learn my information. Right. He goes, well, I don't know who you are as a person. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that, that's how they want to play the Mr. Innocent. I'm protecting myself, you know, but that enough is enough. They use that just to bully, yeah. you know, uh, just like just like this guy. He wants to get up all tall in my face, you know, think I'm going to be like, oh, you know, see you later. Like, nah, you better back up. You better call somebody yeah. that, Once somebody with authority, you know. You know, an, an educated public is, is uh, a threat to them. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you educate the public, and and that's like that's a red flag, you know. Yeah. That's why a lot of these vid, the um, uh, the channels on yeah. YouTube. That's why a lot of get, get taken down. Yeah, they they stop putting stuff up because law enforcement intimidates them to the point where they start parking around the corner. They start following them around, you know. Yeah. They start pulling them over for jump, you know. Oh, you forgot to stop thing. back there. Yeah. Oh, you forgot, you know. Any you you thing. you took that on an orange light, you know, stuff like that, you know. Yeah. And it gets to the point where they don't want the cops to mess with them, so they're like, oh, you know, I'm Just done, you know. I'm I'm scared right. and I'm right. done, you know. Jose. Jose. Yeah. Oh, all oh, right, on man. Good to meet right, you, man. Take care, yeah, man. this place just got educated, man. Um, postal inspector came out and put a stop to it. So hopefully next time we come out, yeah. you'll see a difference. But yeah, that's how it is, man. We have rights out here, you know. Yeah. That's right. And uh, defend your freedom, man. That's right, man. All right. Take care, man. All right. See you later. Yeah, buddy. Supporter, guys. SGV News first. Supporters, guys. They're out there. They're hiding, guys. They're hiding. You know why? Because they're all uneducated so far. They probably see us out here. There's probably supporters out here that see us on a daily basis at their facility and they're just laughing. They're laughing at the manager that just got, you know, put in place. Education, guys. We're out here to spread the word, spread the love, spread the education. Make sure they understand that we are the front line. The public is the front line.